hey there how are you i hope that all of you are well and everything is absolutely amazing on your end welcome back this is your light in darkness and i am back again with another update and another beautiful reading for all of you once again today's update and today's reading is for those individuals who know very well that their counterpart is in other connection or is married to someone else because of their friends or family or because of their manipulation and interference that's what happened okay if this is your situation if you know this already then this reading is for you it's not for those who are not in such kind of a situation if your counterpart is unmarried then the reading is not likely for you okay what i see here is that your counterpart is under influence of a lot of people at the moment or was that's why they went into that other connection or got married they do not have very great friends or really great family members instead i see that they've got really really toxic and mean people around them who did not wanted you to to come together or your connection to prosper that's why they manipulated and interfered in your connection influenced your counterpart actually to get married with someone else choose someone else over you because that looked good on the surface or on screen or on paper okay that was the major reason that's getting highlighted here so now i see that things are changing have changed or are going to change for you i see justice and judgment here for you because you had to endure a lot of pain a lot of sorrow and a lot of suffering because of what happened here because your person left you abandoned you and caused you to go into isolation for fun for materialistic pleasures or gains or to have this company they've got so now i see that it will all be snatched away from them or it got snatched away from them very recently or is just about to dependent on what you're going through and where you are on your journey okay it's going to be different for each and every one of you the point is that you've got all the divine support and protection with you or coming your way so basically you do not have anything to worry about it's just that you have to learn the given lesson or just go with the flow for now because i see that things are about to turn in your favor or outcome is about to happen which you desire which is going to be in your favor or in the favor of your divine connection i see that whoever they got married to whoever they chose over you is not a great person actually such kind of person was brought to them so that they could learn their lessons and get punished or pay the price for betraying you belittling you insulting you humiliating you abandoning you or isolating you so now i'm seeing that after this person takes advantage of your counterpart this person is going to leave them abandon them and betray them in the same exact manner they betrayed you it's not just that it's going to happen only with your counterpart i see that the same situation is going to arise and come into the picture for the people who are the cause behind all of this their friends their family everyone is about to experience major losses separations ending betrayal isolation and depression these people are about to experience the worst phase of their life because that's what they've caused you in many of your cases this is what i see is going on their relationships are now burning i mean they are uh, now experiencing the kind of betrayal and the interference you experienced their happiness is gone or will be gone in the near future they'll be as depressed sad sorrowful and modified as you are right now or as you had been on your journey for quite some time now that's what i see they are attracting here including your counterpart so all in all 
all together in the end i see justice coming your way ending sorrows and suffering getting delivered to them and finally your person choosing to move towards you because i do not see anything else working out for them except for that they'll have to make a choice because everything is going to get snatched away from them it might look like they're enjoying right now it might look like they are living happily because it's all new and it's all fresh it's just a temporary phase so you have to endure this or just kind of ignore it and go with the flow knowing that it'll all come to an end sooner than later it might take some time in some of your cases that's what i see it won't happen overnight this ending won't take place just right after you hear this message or right after they get married or you know come to someone else that's not what i see is going to happen it might take time it is taking time and it took really great amount of time for those this is what i see is going on right now where they recently had an ending with the other person they got betrayed and backstabbed so right now i'm seeing that they are uh, in retreat mode they are hurting they are broken i mean they are um, broken hearted they're slowly moving towards having a breakdown they're already on edge they are thinking a lot about you and what they've done to you their arrogance is shattered their ego is all crushed their attitude is all demolished here that's what i see they are experiencing and that's exactly what these other people are also going to experience on their journey it's going to happen in different ways i'm not saying that or seeing that they'll all be separated from their spouses completely once and for all but i do see bitterness entering into the picture and uh, interference coming in negativity coming in deception happening cheating happening betrayal happening a lot of nosy people interfering jealous people and vicious people are going to come in the picture who are just going to make sure that these people experience the worst kind of situations and circumstances i see their connections or their marriages getting poisoned by the people's negativity and toxicity i see them going into depression slipping into depression experiencing something very very painful or something that's going to push them towards loneliness or into loneliness that's what i see here so i see justice and judgment getting served here in your favor they might be flying high at the moment for those this is what recently happened if they got married to someone else very recently they might be flying high they might be thinking that they want the lottery and and the best of the both worlds no not really nothing as such is going to remain in the picture after a certain point of time but for now it might look like everything's working out and everything's looking hunky dory which not really is the case it's just an illusion they are um, enjoying at the moment let their illusions fade let them have a reality check because once that happens i see all their dreams getting shattered into pieces falling onto the ground i see them crying for help i see them sobbing i see them sulking i see them whining i see them crying for you or crying over the spilled milk i see them crying over the past and regretting over the choices and the decisions they've made so i see a complete end here okay divorce is going to happen for sure or um, a complete separation is going to take place for those divorce are not finalized yet i see them uh, moving on from the situation after a certain point of time because it's going to take a while for things to come to an complete end though the process has already started and they are slowly moving towards better the better is you and your connection because there's no other way for them to escape the plan or run away anywhere that's not going to happen sooner or later eventually they'll be led back towards you or your connection will have to make their uh, wrongs right rectify their wrong doings mend the bond apologize ask for forgiveness and what not so that's what i see but you're getting advice not to jump on to conclusions or anything that piques your interest right away I see a waiting period here for you so don't try to get back with them as soon as they get divorced or separated from their spouse, their wife, their husband or whoever they are dealing with because healing needs to take place and things need to come to an complete end. If that other person is still in the picture, I cannot suggest you to go 
back into your person's life or bring them back in yours because that's just going to complicate things that's just going to create ugly situation for you where you might get blamed for the separation so avoid any of this let them come back to you on their own or let god bring them back to you in divine right timing which is going to take time okay because there's healing that needs to happen there are factors which need to fall into place or you know become clear for you to see there are many things which are not as clear as they need to be or where they need to be so this is what is going to take some time or this is what you need to know so that you do not jump onto conclusions or um, make mistakes you shouldn't be i hope you're getting my point here you're getting advice to go slow or be patient because things are going to take time or are taking time for a reason there's something you do not know there are um, people who are not really great kind of people you're getting protected from you might be getting protected from your own counterpart who lives in a very mindless and atrocious of manner if they are really rude arrogant and mean then it's better that you remain away from them they need to go through this ending or the separation or this betrayal or whatever it is that looks very depressing to me alone so that they can learn their lessons so allow it all to happen and let god take the control you keep things to yourself and keep moving forward that's what i see here for you okay so this was your update this was your reading for today i'll be back sooner than later till then take care of yourself and your loved ones bye bye